Hi guys welcome to another R video. Today we will be looking at AR, Entitled Parent Story, Give My Child You Loaded Gun, Enjoy. Entitled Dad, Hey Give My Kid A Loaded Gun In This Area Full Of People. So some backstory. In my country you need to be licensed to even shoot at a shooting range and to get the license you need to pass some sort of background check, do some extensive paperwork and also attend a one hour class on firearm safety, range safety, the rules and some other stuff about holding a gun correctly etc and also a range class where you shoot with the instructors to see if you may pose any danger to the other shooters. Also we have some sort of necklaces where we have to wear our license card so that other people can see. Our cast, entitled Dad Ed, Hyped Kid HK, Range Instructor E, Club President CP and of course me. So here the story begins. I was at the shooting range training for the IPSC, International Precision Shooting Competition, since I had a qualifier the next day, I passed the qualifier smile, and really didn't want to be bothered. After about an hour there, I go early since there's less people, a dad and a kid that should have been around 15 and looked really hyped to be around guns, I was like him my first time there and I can't blame him, guns are cool, came up to me. I don't know if it was the guns I was using or the metal human shaped target I was shooting that made them come to me specifically, I was using a custom Saiga 12 semi-automatic shotgun with a forward grip, polymer stock red dot etc and to someone unfamiliar with guns it may look like a good AK-47. ED, hey nice gun you have there. Me loading mags, yeah it's great for competitions and the red dot really helps when shooting slugs at small targets. ED, could you let my son shoot it? Me, well your son isn't even old enough to have a license and I wouldn't want to get a strike for giving a non-shooter a gun. If you give a non-shooter a gun after two or three strikes you can have both your shooting license and your gun ownership license revoked. ED, okay can I borrow it since you're going to use your handgun now? I'm licensed. Me, I'm training right now and I need both guns but you can rent a gun just like this one at the van over there. ED, but I don't want to have to walk all the way there and back, it's maybe 25 meters away. HK. Dad let's do it I really want to shoot and also get the paperwork for my training license, the kid looked really serious about it and was willing to spend hours of his life to get the training license which allows him to shoot with supervision from instructors every now and then. He seemed legitimately interested in pursuing it as a sport. At this point I'm starting to search Ed for his license and at that point I spot a visitor's pass basically you can go to the range but aren't allowed to use any guns. You can observe, take a class and the paperwork you need to fill and sometimes CP will let you shoot so that you can decide whether it's for you or not. Me, sir you're not allowed to use a firearm if you're not licensed to do so and I'll get into serious trouble if I let you. You can talk to CP over there and he'll probably let you try a few shots. Ed, no it's nothing serious we will just fire a few shots and no harm will come from it. At that point I had already waved at Ree to come over so maybe he could get him off my back and let me train while the kid had already left and went to find CP to do things the right way. Ree, is there anything I can help with? Me, yeah this person here would like to shoot a gun so maybe you can take him to CP to sort some things out and see what he can do? I always want to see more people into the hobby so I genuinely wanted both of them to have fun. Ree, sure. They talked to CP and under his supervision let them shoot a few rounds with a 9mm and gave them the paperwork and told them that if they want to get licensed to fill it and also come back with a copy of their record. After that the dad came back to me. Ed, okay I talked to CP and as you see he let us shoot so can we shoot your gun now? Me, no I told you I'm not legally allowed to do that. HK, dad just drop it we can come back in a couple of weeks when we've signed up? Ed, why do you have to make such a fuzz about it, me, please let me go back to my training I have an important competition tomorrow and as I said there's nothing I can do. Re shouting for all to hear, guns down, clear them and place the flags in the chambers you can go change targets otherwise just wait for the go ahead to resume shooting. 
I unloaded both guns and put the flag in the receivers and went to check my groupings up close and when I turned back I saw Ed touching the gun, probably because it looked cool I guess, it couldn't fire with the flag in it no matter what he did but now I was pissed so I shouted at both Ree and CP to look at him and they asked him to leave immediately and that he would no T be allowed on the range without doing all necessary steps. For some reason many people across completely stupid around gun, Thanks for watching this R. Entitled Parents video. If you enjoyed, subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss new R. videos share with your friends.